Located along the equator, Lake Victoria is an amazing sight to behold. We have beautiful views of the sunset every, every evening. Uganda, Tanzania and Kenya share the lake that has a surface area of 68,800 square kilometers. Lake Victoria has two rivers flowing out of it, namely the White Nile, also called the Victoria Nile, and the Katoga River. According to environmentalists, 80 percent of this water comes from rain, with the other 20 percent from small streams and rivers flowing into the lake. Lake Victoria's average depth is 40 meters, with the deepest point being 84 meters. The bird life around Lake Victoria is undoubtedly spectacular, with over 350 different birds identified around the lake. also organize different types of trips to different areas of Kenya for those who would be willing to go on safari. Visitors here can engage in bird watching trips both on foot and by boat around the lake. Fish eagles can also be spotted nesting in the fig trees that sprout along the shore of the lake. The lake that is surrounded by scrub, bush, grassland and cultivated habitats is also ideal for water sports such as jet skiing. A tranquil retreat on the shore can also be arranged where travels to Kiboko viewpoints using these traditional adventurous local canals. Been everywhere. <laughs> Telgores, um, Benyore. We went on the water today, which was wonderful. We ate fish. We went and had a Tuscars. I like Tuscars. <laughs> but mostly I like the people here. The people have been wonderful. Um, and the children are wonderful. It's a, a very friendly country. Kisumu is arguably a perfect place to relax and unwind either at the beginning or at the end of your safari. Kisumu is one of the regions that is so vibrant when it comes to tourism matters and as we approach the holiday season once again, let's traverse this beautiful part of the country for a memorable experience of a lifetime. Irene Nchuma Odim, multiple scenes at the Lexit part of the country.